Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Ken Radcliffe filling in for Rob Ryerson, and here's the seafood news for the week of April 23, 2018. In this week's episode, we'll tackle the halibut market. This week's 3-Minute Market Insight is brought to you by Tradex Live, the world's seafood marketplace. Go to live.tradexfoods.com to find your seafood today. It's looking like a tough year ahead for the Pacific halibut industry with quota cuts, inventory buildups, and decreased demand. Back in March, we reported if buyers would make the switch back to Pacific halibut from Atlantic halibut. Evidence in the marketplace suggests that buyers are sticking to fresh Atlantic halibut, keeping inventories of frozen Pacific halibut in the freezers. As Atlantic halibut is becoming more accepted in the marketplace, is created a position for itself against the Pacific halibut with a much lower price point, at times up to $3 better in H&G. The DFO managed Atlantic halibut fishery is open year round, creating a stable supply of fresh Atlantic halibut to the market. Fresh halibut is preferred in almost every application and instance in the marketplace. Dock pricings for Pacific halibut are currently around $4.50 to $5.50 per pound USD. Retail pricing for fresh halibut fillets have been seen on the West Coast between $12 and upwards of $27. This price point can move the product out of reach of consumers. While the demand for is high for fresh halibut, the same can't be said for inventories of frozen halibut. We've seen a dramatic shift in restaurant chains as well, removing the premium priced halibut from menus, placing with other competitively priced whitefish as they make their menu changes. The correlation between frozen halibut prices hitting a ceiling and the current buildup of frozen halibut inventories is very apparent. With the abundance of frozen halibut inventories in the marketplace now, there could still be more room for prices to fall. On March 23rd, the IPHC released its revised 2018 Pacific halibut catch limits in what they are calling now more restrictive. Total U.S. and Canadian catch limits is set at 27.93 million pounds, down 11% from the 2017 limit of 31.4 million pounds. Compare this to the Atlantic halibut quota set at 1,297 metric tons, or roughly 2.8 million pounds. Atlantic halibut by no means become a complete substitute for Pacific halibut, However, its competitive edge in fresh sales, accessibility, and price has helped to gain national acceptance as an alternative for fresh and frozen. 2040 H&G Pacific Halibut is sitting around $6.50 U.S. FOB Bellingham for 2017 inventories. The same spec in Atlantic Halibut is sitting around $5.35 USD FOB Boston for 2017 inventories again. If you are looking to purchase halibut, give our seafood specialists a call first and we'll make sure your next move is the right move. To wrap this episode up, our Tradex Live offer of the week is Sinbad Pacific Halibut Fletches. These are 8 to 16 ounce, twice frozen, deep skinned, and in our Sinbad brand, which are backed by a 100% net weight guarantee. We have an incredible price on these available in Vancouver at $11.99 USD. Click or tap the icon above to view the offer. If you have a topic you'd like to hear on upcoming 3-Minute Market Insights, tweet us at Tradex Foods or leave a comment below in this YouTube of Facebook video. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. This is Ken Radcliffe. Buy smart and eat more seafood. 